Although de facto still dependent on US-made defense equipment, the Turkish Air Force has made a revolutionary breakthrough, namely, no longer using US source code to test new types of weapons on the F-16 Fighting Falcon fighter jet. This is possible thanks to the adoption of UBAS. UBAS is the Aircraft Independent Firing System, a combination of applications and hardware in the form of tablets that allow Turkish-made weapons to be used without modifying the software on the core mission software on the F-16 fighter jet. What is unique is that the interface on UBAS uses a tablet console. The use of tablets to support missions by fighter pilots is actually not a news story, but in the UBAS trial, the tablet was installed on the cockpit dashboard precisely installed on the input control panel. The device, used in conjunction with a second tablet attached to the pilot's knee, supports mission operations, weapons deployment, and navigation tasks. And the first successful UBAS test was conducted on the SOM-J air-launched cruise missile standoff missile. A video on social media has shown the test launch of the locally developed SOM-J missile from an F-16 Block 40 belonging to the Turkish Air Force's 401st Test Squadron. The UBAS, developed with Turkish mission software, provides an independent interface between the aircraft and the new indigenous weapon. This allows integration without access to the F-16's operational flight program source codes. The UBAS is currently operational on the upgraded F-16 Block 40 and Block 50, which received modernization under the Common Configuration Implementation Program that was completed in 2015. The SOMJ is a long-range missile produced domestically by Roketsam, based on the design of the early SOM missile. Originally intended to be carried internally on the F-35A stealth fighter, the SOM missile has now been adapted for use on the F-16 and F-4E Phantom. The SOMJ has a range of around 275 kilometers and is guided via GPS and inertial navigation with an infrared seeker on the terminal phase. The integration of the SOMJ with UBAS directly demonstrates Turkey's ability to adapt its existing aircraft fleet to new capabilities despite limited access to U.S. software systems. UBAS is not limited to the SOMJ Turkey A. Today said that UBAS supports other locally developed munitions, such as the HGK GPS guided bomb, the KGK glide bomb, and the LGK-82 laser-guided bomb all variations of widely used Western designs tailored to Turkish needs. Air-to-air -air weapons integration also continues on Turkish F-16s, although they do not appear to use UBAS. Tablet-based interfaces are a broader trend in military aviation, where legacy platforms are gaining new functionality without extensive hardware modifications. A similar approach has been adopted in Ukraine, where tablets allow Soviet-era warplanes to use or launch Western-made weapons.